Okay. Today we're going to deal with uh, hip flexibility and hip restrictions. Okay. Uh, we're going to test three things: hip flexibility. Okay. We're going to test strength of the hip and stability of the hip. Okay. So in a time massage setting, uh, very easily. Can you lie down, please? We can test the hamstrings. Normal is about 70 degrees, 90 is pretty fantastic, so the hamstrings are on tight. We can check the adductors, so external rotation, okay. you're looking for about 65, that is almost 90, fine, it's not tight. Internal rotation, which is checking the lateral rotators. Okay, so the glute medius, minimus, piriformis, okay, the deep rotators, check, internal, that's great, you could go further. Most of your clients will have very good external, most of your clients will have bad internal rotation. Okay. A um, couple more things you could check, uh, we'll use a Thomas test for the psoas. TFL and the right fan. So, Dora, I need you to sit against the table. Okay. And go for the back. Okay. Can you hold that knee for me, please? Just like that, straight on. Alright, so briefly, someone's got a tight psoas. Psoas will not allow the thigh to drop. It will actually be up here. It's quite rare to have a tight psoas. Anyway, it's not tight. Fine. TFL, you want to see how far the patella sits off the midline. So there's the ASIS, there's the patella, maybe half an inch. If the leg was abducted out to here, sure, TFL would be tight. Okay, in this case, right. The rack fem, which crosses two joints, if it was tight, this is almost perfect. Be out here. Okay, you can check. It feels so easy. So, clear the rack fem, TFL, psoas, hamstrings, external, internal rotators. Nothing's tight. Okay.